talk to you today about Alzheimer's people and the tremendous volume of care that is provided to them by family members who either aren't paid or they're not paid the right way. Um, all the statistics tell us that if family members were paid for providing the care they provide to Alzheimer's, those payments would add up to billions of dollars a year. The fact that it's unpaid is unfortunate for a number of reasons. Let's, let's talk about why. First of all, you may not have known that if the family member with Alzheimer's is a wartime veteran or widowed from one, um, payments to a family member caregiver can support a claim for VA benefits that can be very helpful. Um, second, people worry about the Medicaid look back rule and spend down. Well, Payments to a caregiver, if they're done in a legally correct way, written contract, dot the I's, cross the T's, um, are permissible spend down. They're not gift transfers. But on the other hand, if they're done the wrong way, just pay you some money on the side, give you a gift, not going to you know have you charge me. Um, those are considered transfers, and even if they're well-intentioned um, and the person really did do the work, they're a killer when it comes to Medicaid eligibility. They're considered gift transfers, and they're going to cause substantial delays in eligibility. So the lesson here is if you have Alzheimer's, and are being cared for by a family member, or if you are a family member providing care to somebody with Alzheimer's, please get thee to an elder law attorney and get the help that you need. Thanks.